Van Engineering Newswire, we're throwing flames with the X Matter, flying the world's largest plane, and getting a real explanation for how the Lexus hoverboard works. Over the past few decades, Hollywood has turned a tool used mostly for control burns and ground clearing into a weapon to threaten or exterminate one's enemies. Aliens, anyone? For better or for worse, the purchase of a flamethrower has been financially impractical for most Americans. Well, times are a-changin' with the creation of the X Matter X15 flamethrower retailing for around $1,600. The Ohio-based company, X Matter, claims the device can hold 3.3 gallons of fuel and can shoot flames up to 50 feet right out of the box. If you aren't fascinated or a little terrified yet, the company also offers a separate napalm mix, which shoots from 10 to 15 feet further than the 90% 10% mixture. And surprisingly, the selling and purchasing of flamethrowers is largely unregulated in the US. The Bureau of Alcohol, Tobacco, Firearms, and Explosives doesn't technically consider flamethrowers a firearm, so anyone over the age of 18 not living in California or Maryland could purchase one right now. The world's largest plane is set to launch next year. The Stratolaunch carrier aircraft could change the way we travel to space. Powered by six 747-class engines and a weight of 1,200,000 pounds, the plane will climb to 30,000 feet to launch a rocket, reaching a maximum speed of around 530 miles per hour. The company is reportedly working with Orbital ATK to develop the rocket, but other companies and launch vehicle options may be considered. The vehicle's first missions will be to deliver satellites weighing up to 13,000 pounds into orbit around 100 to 1,200 miles above Earth. However, someday the plane could launch the Dream Chaser to send astronauts into orbit. Construction is currently underway at the Mojave Air and Spaceport in California. To date, they have used more than 200,000 pounds of composite structure for the vehicle. Flight testing will begin in 2016 with the first launch of the Space Launch Vehicle, likely taking place in 2018 from one of several launch sites under consideration. It's here! What? The Lexus Hoverboard. I thought it already was. Well, not really. Now Lexus has unveiled a video of some substance and new information regarding its design. According to the company, creating the hoverboard named Slide required re-engineering various technologies. This included finding the right combination of superconductors, magnets, and liquid nitrogen. The hoverboard is constructed from an insulated core that contains high temperature superconducting blocks. The blocks are housed in a reservoir of liquid nitrogen called cryostats, which cool them to negative 197 degrees Celsius. When placed on a surface that contains permanent magnets, magnetic flux lines are pinned into place. And the board hovers. It has taken Lexus months of testing to develop the maglev technology into the track and board we see today. The park which we see in the new video features a traditional skate park design, but required refining in order to best suit the unique ride of the hoverboard. A ride which seems a little difficult to achieve. They all, they all keep falling. Do you have story ideas? Comment below and we'll cover them in an upcoming episode. For the PDND channel, I'm Kaylee Duffy and this has been your Engineering Newswire.